Hey everyone, it's Raphael from XX Raphael Productions, and we're going to be doing Billy Idol's Dancing with Myself. So, onto the video, let's get right to it. Alright, so here we go, let's get right to the song, but before we go ahead and show you what to strum first, let me go ahead and first tell you that this guitar is set to standard shooting, so make sure you've got the notes down on screen, it's E, A, D, G, B, E, from the low E to the high E, so second thing is that this guitar that I currently have, I have a pedal, this metal zone, it, I used this as well for my other guitar videos, but that is how I get the sound for the intro, and I also for when I do the, you know, the chords later. So, just in case you're wondering what effect I use, that is the pedal that I'm using. Okay, so now onto the actual notes to us to pluck. What we're gonna do is focus on this string, the G string, and we're gonna go and um, put down your middle finger on the ninth fret and then your index on the eighth. That way, when we do this, so. So make sure you've got the correct notes down, it'll be... And then you're gonna, you're gonna slide down to the 11th fret, okay? So, <coughs> the intro is actually pretty easy. Yeah, so hopefully you get the idea. It, all you gotta do is just do the 9, 8, 11, then back to a 9, alright? Now you can... The, when it comes to the plucking pattern, you can decide whichever one sounds the best for you, but I would say, in the actual song, the way I heard it, it was... Now, personally, when I get to the last part, I like to kind of... I like to vibrate the string a little bit like this, but that is optional, obviously, but I think it sounds better when you do that for some of the, like, when you're, well, I guess when you're trying to play the intro, you can kind of mess around with the string as well. But yeah, that's simply all you gotta do for the intro, and then when you go to the verses, you'll play the E. Okay, so let's get to verses, and then the, here's the chorus now. Did you notice something? The chords for the verses and for the chorus are actually the same thing. So, really, let's go ahead and show you the E. So, we'll simply, you gotta put down your middle finger on the a, a string on the 2nd fret, and then your ring finger directly underneath that, and then put your index on the G on the 1st fret, alright? And then... So this is A, so you're gonna bar the entire 5th fret, and then put your ring finger on the A string on the 7th fret, and then put your index underneath that, okay? And that should be an A. And then to play the B, you're only gonna do, don't change anything, just simply, simply slide it two frets. So you're not, you're not changing any of your finger positions, you're just sliding it down to the second fret like that. So then, let's go ahead and do the chorus. Versus this will be... Yeah, so hopefully you get the idea that the, the only thing really that you have to worry about is simply the... basically the strum pattern. That's all you gotta worry about for the verses and the chorus. The, now, when it comes to the second verse, after the first chorus, you might hear the lead guitar doing... You'll hear that in the background, so you'll have the lead guitar doing the same intro tab, and then you'll have the rhythm guitarist doing the, the strumming, okay? So, that's all you gotta worry about for the rest of the song. And now, the only thing left is really the mini solo that comes around the middle of the song, where we're gonna simply focus on the uh, second and fourth fret, so... Uh... 
Yeah, so I have the tab on top as well so you can see the way it is played, but all you gotta do is strum the the strings all of them four times. So it'll be So what we're gonna do is the we're gonna strum the A string and then directly underneath that the D and then slide to the fourth fret, still the D string. And then directly after that is the G. So I'll play it slowly for you. And then the original speed. Yeah, so then, then you get back to the to the usual. So that's simply how you play Billy Idol's dancing with myself and as you can clearly see, it's not too difficult, you just gotta really worry about the timing of the song per se, and yeah, you can listen to the original one, which I will link the original song in the description below, just so you guys can kind of work out the timing if you need, it, if you need to. But there you go, that's the entire song, and hopefully this video helped you out, and if it did, leave a like, and definitely comment down below if you've got any extra questions. Till then, Raphael out, and I will see you soon.